Hey guys, um, so I got, uh, Final Cut, um, Pro X, Final Cut Pro 10, whatever you want to call it, and, um, I don't think it's the greatest thing ever, I mean, if you have iMovie, and you don't think you're going to be able to work something like that, and I do have Final Cut Express here below, um, then go ahead and buy Final Cut Pro X, get used to that, then you'll start, you know, getting used to all the other things. But, yeah, so today I wanted to show you, I've been actually, when I first got it, uh, hold on, I found out how to, uh, I didn't, I didn't know how to do muzzle flash, then I started looking around, and I eventually found it. So, um, it was kind of hard to find. It was a lot harder than the other one. So, yeah. So, um, first you're going to need... So, yeah, this is a mother flash tutorial. First you're going to need some original clips. I mean, the original clip you want to use. Kind of like that, anything. With recoil or something like that. Then you're going to want to need... You're going to need... Uh, side view muzzle flash. So I'm gonna take one. See there. Now you're actually gonna leave it there, and then going frame by frame, you're gonna want to find it. Find where the uh, where you where you begin the recoil. Get right there. Take it and try to get it there because it's a lot harder and final cut pro X. And so as you'll see, I'll be playing it. And it's gonna go black. So I'm gonna take it. Um first I'm gonna go back to where I need it to go. Right there. Yeah. Okay, it's there. Okay. So I'm gonna what I do is I would click on the clip that I'm doing, which is that which is the muzzle flare. So you'll take the muzzle flare, so so press I Right here, go down, click on screen, kind of put it down a little bit. I know I put it all the way up. But then I'm gonna crop it, not crop it, move it like with that button. Um, and then I'm gonna pop it, maybe a little smaller. No, I didn't do that. I think it's that. There. A little bit. See how this looks? Okay, that looks pretty good. So, from there, you're gonna wanna probably want some sound so you'll. Improve the set or yeah, I'm first off. I have a whole thing of this stuff, this chunk. Special effects. I mean, all fine. I'll probably just use this for now. It's probably one of the worst ones I have right now, but then you're gonna want to match it up. I'm not gonna be able to get it exactly right there, so. Go right where the muzzle flare is. There. Then match the sound up right with it. Alright, that should look good. Now we're going to test that out. 
looks pretty good. So, um, and what I was saying in the beginning was, you know, Final Cut, Final Cut Pro X is not the best. So, if you have Final Cut Express, and you know how to work all this stuff, or Final Cut Pro, don't get Final Cut Pro X, unless you can get some kind of version, I don't really know. But yeah, so, that was my little thingy me about it. And, uh, hopefully I'll have more. So, I'll see you guys later.